Class is back in session here at Emmett High School, and freshmen are not the only new Huskies on campus. I'm your Emmett neighborhood reporter, Alexander Huddleston, and I spoke with the school's brand new activities director, Kevin Beard, about some of the changes coming to the athletics facilities. Contractors are hard at work on this new wave of field installing the brand new $1.2 million turf football field. I think the community is going to be excited for it. It'll allow us to hold like maybe some state playoff games for some of the lower level teams. The new field fitted with dark blue end zones is the newest piece of the stadium beautification project over the last few years that has added a new press box and shiny new bleachers. I think it will also be a lot safer for our athletes too just because it has that cushion to it that grass normally doesn't. However, this turf will benefit not only football, but both men and women's soccer team, as well as the marching band. Band kids, the turf becomes, the football field becomes a second home, just like it does for the football players. We out there, we're out there and we're practicing a lot, and um, so we spend a lot of time on there. But this may not be the final update to Emmett High's athletic facilities. So th there's a few things that I think you know, we really need. Kevin Beard, Emmett native and the brand new activities director for his alma mater, has big plans to keep this growth going. It would be really nice to have an auxiliary gym. Um, there's some communication going on about that possibly. Another big thing that's coming up this fall is um, our track coach has developed a project to get us a whole bunch of new shot put pits. And then on top of that, I would really like to see us get some lights for our baseball field. The new turf will make its public debut on Friday night when Husky football hosts Canyon Ridge. I'm your Emmett neighborhood reporter, Alexander Huddleston, Idaho News 6.